hi guys welcome to this video from online to helper and uh, in today's video we want to look at the another aspect in email marketing email blasting if you want to blast your emails you want to send spam messages at the rest and if you want to send your broadcast yeah there's a mail with application is a self-host mailing application if you know about get response um if you know about mailchimp and uh it is now a mail with an application whereby it allows you to create your own list, send your own book SMS, sorry, book messages, and uh, it allows you to create a template. You can copy, you can put in your uh, LTML template files and send your messages. So this is a look of mail with application. If we are setting up this for you, we're gonna set up with an SMTP server whereby it allows you to send an unlimited messages and uh, you have your server in this way let me show you and that's it um, this is your server is a power mta you can see what we've been sending in and uh, this is what we sent out so far and this is the messages we, we received uh, and uh, you can see this is the total maximum you can send in the day you can see five million Plus. so this is an unlimited emailing server so we can set up this mailing server together with uh, your mail with application so after we set up your mail with application for you you need to log in click on login right here uh, to log in your account so it's asking for emails and password so let's go back to the back end of this um, server and create a user okay so this is the back end as you can see this is our back end of the server and um, what we need to do here we have a lot of things or a lot of stuff here user we have the customer and blah 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 so you have the settings the pages the articles location the extent the blacklisting and the rest so to do this you go to the user click on user so from the user, click on create new. So I want to create a new user for this video. So I'll say the first name is online. Okay, last name is to over. Okay, so then the email will be online to over at gmail.com. So is this if this is your first time of uh, watching this video? Checking on our YouTube channel, kindly do well to hit on the subscribe button to stay updated on our related uh, softwares. So I will pick a password and let me say, okay, so once this is done, status to make it active, then now uh, hit the button save changes. See, it has been saved successfully. Now we're going to going back here to log in the details. This is the email we use and the password. Then I'll click on login. So once you log in like this, you can see this is the mail. Yeah, here you check your results, you can see the click rate will be here, the open rate will be here, the pass rate will be here. So um okay. So we can go around this and say, okay, this is the list. This is where you create your email list and the rest. So this is the campaign aspect where you're going to send, excuse me, where you're going to send your messages and uh, these are the categories, API key and so forth. So to do this, the first thing you need to do is to create a list. So we'll go to list and click on list. So from this list, then you're going to create another list. So you click on create new. This is where you're going to import your mailing app. So you can name this. Um, you can name it. So say, okay, to help a subscriber. That's the name. I want to name, name it. So from this. So the the default by default it will be from this then from emails so you apply to these emails so you can put the subject if you want to do I can say hello for now so you can add description just a list. 
Okay, let's delete. Okay, so that means we need to set. Then blah blah blah. Everything is there. So, so in case if you wanna do um promoting the product, so you want your um subscriber to make an action, you can see subscriber action. So what do you want them to do once they click on subscription? This is another program, this is another tutorial for you to learn how to uh run the sequence marketing like uh, after once they subscribe to your part to your to your channel or whatever things you are promoting online or um, how you want the emails to be entering into their mailing box so this is another tutorial for the time so we're not going there right now so just click on save changes so back to list okay okay it contains an error so I think we have to fill in this info. So just fill this. So EQS in the United States. United States. So let's say California. Just leave it that way. again go back to the list all right it's now saved successfully okay so we have this this is the second list i've created so now we need subscriber inside this list so to do that you can either um click on all subscriber first you can see you have the list of um, your subscribers so we're not going there right now so what we need to do is to go on those um so we click on this um, unique ID. Take us to the back end. You can see our subscribers is zero. The custom feed. You can see the pages. Um, we have some templates on the pages. So we just okay. Click on the subscribers. Then let's add a new subscriber. So I'm just going to add one of my new. You can see create new. Click on create new. So this key. Okay, just put one. Email right here. I can say to Alpha Gmail.com. So let's say so the doors that confirm this. Then I'll click on save changes and reach. So these subscribers have been added. You can go back. So from here, in case if you, want, if you have a large number of lists you want to upload, so this is what you're going to do. You click on a uh, uh, bulk action from source, and you select the file. And that is from text. You can just copy and paste right here. Then you scroll down, and you put the action whatever you want to do. You can subscribe subscribe and click on submit okay so that's that and how to create a in a, a list and now you can add a subscriber so we go to the campaign now go to the campaign aspects campaigns then you can click on create new campaign if you want to send your messages so, okay, let's say create new campaign put the campaign name Okay, the low as a campaign name, then uh, the type okay, is regular, not to respond that. The list you pick on, okay, this is what we just created, and uh, that's all. Click on save the next. So, to send message, you click on create new and fill in your campaign name and uh, other information, and click it then next year. Then the subjects here, I'll just say, how are you? And scroll down to next. So you just type in your message here and click on send. Um, just set the time and click on send. Then click on send campaign and let's wait for it. It's sent, so it's pending. So wait for a few seconds. You can see it's sent and yes, 